a whole host of high-profile celebrities expressed their unhappiness on learning that their blue ticks had been removed. Elon Musk had announced plans for the tick, which was previously used to verify identities and confirm which celebrities were the real deal, to only be available to paying customers as part of his Twitter blue scheme. However, some disgruntled public figures lost their status overnight, leading Ricky Gervais to jokingly question whether he was really him. Meanwhile, some critics claim that the system could make it easier for scam accounts with a fake verification tick to impersonate someone else. In a dig at Ellen's failed SpaceX rocket launch yesterday, Greg James tweeted, I lost my blue tick but your rocket blew up so who's the real loser? However, not all fans were sympathetic, and as some discussed the space explosion, at the boy underscore LCFC hit back, the fact that you're even discussing something so mediocre as a blue tick is so sad. Who cares, big deal. You're still a successful radio host. Get on with it. Meanwhile, Ricky Gervais penned his own tweet, complaining, My blue tick has gone. I'm not sure if I'm really me or not. Piers Morgan confirmed he was unsure whether or not to fork out the $8 per month for the privilege of upgrading to Twitter Blue. Breaking, I'm pondering the removal of my blue tick by Atelan Musk and will make a decision about what I will do. Tomorrow, he told almost 9 million followers. Fans urged the multimillionaire to pay the fee, with it the Posey Parker reminding him free speech comes with a small price. Channel 5's Dan Walker made it clear he had zero intention of paying out, simply writing, farewell blue tick. It was nice knowing you hashtag legacy verified. At whose daddy 60 joked, seems a lot of blue ticks going today. Is this due to Elon's rocket exploding? Sorry I meant rapid unscheduled disassembly. Meanwhile, actor Tony Maudsley seemed equally unconcerned, chuckling, so my blue tick has been wiped away. In not that a D really. You'll post a new profile pic in a few days of me holding a blue tick so you still know it's me. I guess that amounts to pretty much the same thing really? Ian McKellen has also insisted, please note that I am not paying for the blue check mark, which I've displayed for many years. William Shatner, who played Star Trek's Captain Kirk, was equally unhappy, declaring the new system a money grab. However, stars such as Holly Willoughby and Susanna Reid are still displaying their ticks, suggesting they may have shelled out to retain them.